We have got a lion, we have got a lion. I don't know which lion it is, but unfortunately she is disappearing towards Sydney's dam. But she was calling. She was doing a call, so she's definitely looking for the others. So we'll try and watch her as much as we can. I did just call another vehicle into the sighting, so hopefully uh, they'll get closer. She's in Biffle's Hook now going towards the Manuleti, and they will hopefully supply us with some light. She's got a rather large stomach, though, from what I can see. Okay, I'm going to put my spotlight down, and we'll use theirs. But it is quite difficult. She's so far away from us, but I can't tell you who it is. I don't know if I can see. There's no, it doesn't look like there's any suckle marks there. Have a little listen. She's calling. Now you can hear how sort of soft and subtle a lioness's call is compared to a big male's call. Not as deep and gruff and loud as a girl. And I'm sure this is one of the lionesses from the Nkuhumba Pride. It could be amber eyes, but like I said, it's very, very difficult to tell, obviously looking in this light. And she must be about oh, quite a distance away from us. Oh, there's another car. Let's see if we can see her. She's going down towards the dam, so I'm wondering if she isn't going to have a drink. We can just see her shadow. Where did she go? She, she just vanished. I think she's just ducked out of view down towards Sydney's dam. Very, very difficult for us to see her, and unfortunately we can't go traversing there. But that was wonderful. I wonder if she's going to come back. I think what we're going to do is let's go do a quick loop. Let's go do uh, and check Simbambili because if she's calling now, that could draw the attention of the males. So I am just going to tell uh, the guides in the sighting to carry on, but if they can let us know if she comes back this way because she did. We saw her across the road from quite far down and she's come from Voyatella. But let's go across to Abby and the rest of the Nkuhumas.